Well, hey guys, this is Alex. Um, another one with my new lighting system. If you guys have any feedback, that'd be great. This is a little, uh, probably like a vending machine lock or something that I found in the garage when I was looking for some stuff. It's a Chicago. Um, it is a wafer, wafer tumbler lock. Um, kind of a neat old thing. Or at least I assume it's somewhat old. The, the uh, key looks kind of grungy. Um, so, it turns both ways, which is nice. So, I don't have to get in your way as much. But, let's come in with a diamond. And, uh, that center ward does actually run all the way down the lock. So, have to kind of wiggle in there a little bit. And we come to the top. This should go pretty fast, but... get on that one. Okay, that's a good sign that I've got everything but one set. So we'll come back in here, see what we got. There it is. So, I do actually kind of like picking wafer locks. They're very responsive. Um, actually, the diamond is probably not quite the right tool because it Kind of the wafers are thin, and it kind of like you saw in that that front one that I was working on when it made the big click. It kind of wants to slip off, but anyway, here's the lock. Um, this one has a screw in it for reasons that I I don't know that I don't understand, and I believe that the core, if I can get it back to locked, the core will actually sort of wants to come out. There it is, so you can actually see the. There it is with everything at the shear line. Is that in good focus? Let's come in a little bit. Oh, that's as in as we get. So there's a, there it is at the shear line. And that goes into this chamber here. So it's a good opportunity to take that stupid screw out. Um, so you can see the little sort of slots that that goes into. And then as the key comes out, you can see that the levers stick up. I'm not going to take them all, or wafers. I'm not going to take it all the way out because I don't want to risk having everything fall out on me. Um, so, probably could use a little lubrication. But anyhow, so, there we go. And I got that stupid screw out of there. So, uh, Acme, I'm sorry, Chicago. Chicago lock, at least that's who made the key. Um, on the codes match, so yeah. Uh, Chicago Lock uh, Wafer Cylinder SPP'd. Anyway, this is Alex. Thanks for watching, and as always, have fun and keep it legal. Cheers.